Fire Service Series PFES. Verbal Question The first written records of the ancient Olympic Games date to 776 BC, when a cook named Corobus won the only event a 192-meter foot race called the Stade, the origin of the modern stadium to become the first Olympic champion. However, it is generally believed that the Games had been going on for many years by that time. Legend has it that Hercules, son of Zeus and the mortal woman Alcmene, founded the Games, which by the end of the 6th century BC had become the most famous of all Greek sporting festivals. The ancient Olympics were held every four years between August 6 and September 19 during a religious festival honoring Zeus. Their influence was so great that ancient historians began to measure time by the four-year increments in between Olympic Games, which were known as Olympiads. After 13 Olympiads, two more races joined the state as Olympic events, the Diallos and the Diligos. The pentathlon was introduced in 708 BC, boxing in 688 BC and chariot racing in 680 BC and 648 BC, pancration a combination of boxing and wrestling with virtually no rules, debuted as an Olympic event. Participation in the ancient Olympic Games was initially limited to freeborn male citizens of Greece, there were no women's events, and married women were prohibited from attending the competition. Source, The Olympic Games, www.history.com web link. Question. According to this passage, when did the Olympics become the most famous of all Greek sporting events? Answer can be found in the second sentence of the first paragraph. Legend has it that Hercules, son of Zeus and the mortal woman Alcmene, founded the Games, which by the end of the 6th century BC had become the most famous of all Greek sporting festivals. Hence, the answer is by the end of the 6th century BC.